another video i'm so excited to not really start this on my youtube because it was on my reddit her um it's on our reddit her youtube channel and now i'm transitioning it to my personal youtube but it's a a segment that i like to call macy talks where basically i just throw my mouth like i just talk about different subjects different things that's going on different topics that are related to women and i just voice my opinion and i hope in the comments you guys can talk and voice your opinions and we can have open dialogue and dialogue about different subjects and different things that are affecting us women so if you have not subscribed go ahead and subscribe hit that subscribe button so you can join the family hold on join the family okay and you can you know make it official like a referee with a whistle okay we don't need you to just be viewing the videos but you ain't subscribed we need you to be subscribed doing the videos like comment and sharing okay so for today's video i really just want to just talk um this has been something that has been on my mind lately and it's just something that I hope can be a word of encouragement just to you all out there who are maybe starting a journey, maybe in the middle of a journey, maybe feeling like you want to give up, feeling like you want to give in. And I kind of talked about this a little bit on my Instagram the other day, but I kind of just wanted to expand a little bit and just kind of give my opinion. So it's crazy because like y'all starting this YouTube channel for me, a lot of people was like, girl, it's really not that big of a deal but for somebody like me it took a huge leap of faith simply because I am an overthinker to my heart like I I plan things out and I overthink it and I overthink it and I think about all the things that could possibly go wrong like oh my goodness what if nobody subscribes what if nobody pays it attention what if the content isn't good what if people don't like it da 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 and it's something that I've dealt with for so long, just overthinking and overanalyzing and nitpicking every little thing. And by me really diving into trying to, well, working towards becoming a full-time content creator, it's really forcing me to shake a lot of fears that I have. And it's forcing me to face myself in a lot of ways and do the things that I've been saying that I wasn't gonna, that I've said that I was gonna do. I was so discouraged from doing YouTube and just creating content because I feel like it was so oversaturated. I feel like everybody is an influencer. Everybody is aspiring to be an influencer. Everybody's trying to, you know, start a YouTube channel. Everybody's trying to do this and trying to do that. And I felt like the market was so oversaturated. So it's like, what's the point of even trying? But then I had to realize, sit back and realize, like, what exactly did God tell me to do? What exactly is my purpose on this earth? What if I prayed to God and what has he shown me? in my prayers through my everyday life of what I'm supposed to be doing. One thing I know for sure, it cannot be an oversaturated market if it's your God-given purpose. If it is what God has called you to do, it's no such thing as an oversaturated market. I see this meme going around Instagram a lot and it's so true. When you look down the bread aisle, you see Sarah Lee, that's the only one I can think of right now, but <laughs> you see a bunch of different breads and People are buying a little bit of all of them. People are buying Kroger brand bread. They're buying Publix brand bread. They're buying Sara Lee. They're buying all the different types of bread. They're buying Arnold's. Okay, they're not, Arnold's not caring about Sara Lee. Sara Lee not caring about the Kroger brand. Kroger brand not caring about the Publix brand. They're walking in their own lanes. And the people that are meant to support them, the people that are meant to purchase their products, that's who they cater to and if it's somebody out there who's feeling discouraged or feeling like oh I don't want to go back to school to become this or I don't want to start this or I don't want to take a leap on this just do it I'm a firm believer and I will say it again if it's your God-given purpose there's no such thing as it being oversaturated it's no such thing as too many people are doing it to be honest y'all we are we really out here doing the same exact thing but we going about it completely different ways it's nothing out there that has never been done it's nothing out there that nobody has ever done. Somebody's done it, you know, but they have catered to maybe a different audience. They have went about it in a different way. And I just feel like as women, we have to learn to face those fears, stand up to those fears and tell them, you know what? Yes, I'm scared. I am shaking in my boots. I am terrified. But guess what? I 
am going to do this because let me tell you something not achieving your dreams not living up to your fullest potential not being the person that God has called you to be will keep you up at night it will keep you angry it will frustrate you it will depress you it will eat away at you until you live to be the person that God has called for you to be I am such I'm, I'm, I'm sitting here telling y'all this because if I can, out of everything that I've been through, out of literally the dirt, the gravel, the rock, the concrete that I had to grow out of, and for me to be able to say, you know what, the past is the past, it is what it is, as scared as I am, as afraid as I am, I'm going to do it. And no, it's not perfect, I'm still learning along the way, I'm still making a bunch of errors I'm still trying to figure it out but the fact that I'm doing it is the fact that's a positive you know what I'm saying you're not gonna get it right the first time or the second or maybe sometimes even the third but you gotta get up and do something you have to get up and do something manifestation you can manifest all you want you can be like I'm gonna be a millionaire I'm gonna be a millionaire but if you're not doing anything to secure the bag boo boo it's just a bunch of idle babbers it's just a bunch of idle babble. If you're not doing anything to secure them funds, if you're not doing anything to lock down the funds, then it's no purpose of even talking about it. People always talk about manifest, 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 but you gotta put some work behind the manifestation, just like prayer and faith. Prayer and faith, it doesn't mean nothing if you're not putting that hard work towards it. So today, ladies, okay, <laughs> okay, okay, we are going to put the work behind the actions we are going to let go of the fear and we are going to do what we are called to do we are going to do what god has ordained for us to do we're going to do it scared we're going to do it shaking in our knees we're going to do it apprehensive we're going to do it not perfect but the thing is we are going to do it okay do not be afraid to jump y'all i'm telling y'all this content creating and, 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 and making it full time and making it a full time stream of income, one of them at least, it's not easy. It's not. And sometimes, I'm going to be honest, I do look at other people around me and I get discouraged because, you know, I'm at a standstill on some things and I'm like, okay, I need this to grow. But then I constantly remind myself that this is a marathon. It's not a sprint. And every day that I take a step, every post that I put, every content that I create, that's a step towards the end of this journey. That's a step along this journey. I'm No, I'm not speeding running, but I'm taking a nice little jog. And while I'm jogging, I'm learning and I'm growing and I'm maturing so that when I reach that level, I'm able to handle it. You know what I'm saying? Because it will be a shame for you to get the success and for you to get all those things and you're not ready for it and you end up losing it. So as I'm going along my journey, I'm constantly asking, praying for discernment. I'm constantly praying that God prepare me. I'm constantly praying that God, you know, just continue to show me myself so I never lose sight of the goal and that I'm always aligned with his will. Because that's important. You can manifest all you want to. You can pray all you want to. But if it's not his will, it's not going to happen. You have to constantly as you're manifesting. I always like to end it with according to your will. Like, okay, God, this is what I want. But I would like it according to your will. If it's even in your will for me. So y'all know I, I babble. I will go on and on. I will go to about 17,000 different subjects. But... I just felt it on my heart to just come in there and tell y'all this where I literally through Macy Talks just drop some encouragement to get you through the week. Just something to, you know, if you feeling a little down, you feeling a little ill, just something to really just raise you up and let you know, girl, the world is waiting to be blessed by your gift. The world is waiting for that gift and that talent and those skills that God has given to you. They're ready to be blessed by that. So get up sis get up and do what needs to be done not only for you but for the generations to come because you never know who your gift may bless you never know what your gift how your gift may change and affect this world so yeah mm -hmm. yeah so just to know that every single step that you take y'all is one step closer to the bigger goal forget looking at other people's grass 
tend to your own grass. Yeah, their grass may be a lot greener, but you don't know what products they put in their grass. If their grass is artificial, you don't know what they did to get there. You don't know what trials and tribulations and heartaches and setbacks that they went through to get to that point. So stop, stop worrying about other folks. Worry about you and your journey and your path. Worry about you and pray, manifest, work hard, and I promise you, y'all, you will get there. Just don't give up. Don't give in. Stop worrying about everybody else. How many people doing it? How what they got? How much money they make? How many? Worry about you. Okay. Step into your destiny. Step into the role that God has called for you to fill. And girl, it ain't nothing up from here. We ain't going nowhere but up from here. Okay, so that's it. I'm done talking. Y'all know I could ramble forever, but no, seriously, I'm done. But just really inspired you. And if you are inspired, comment down below, you know, just talk to me. Like, look at me as like your girlfriend, like your sis, okay, girl? Like your little therapist, okay? <laughs> your little real cute therapist <laughs> you know and just talk to me um do not forget to follow me on instagram and like my facebook page and subscribe to my blog and do not forget to follow our network for women at rated her um we have some dope merch over there that we are dropping for the fall and we are so excited so if you have not followed us follow us and if you ain't bought nothing sis bro if you watching Go ahead over there. Buy some right now. Okay, and I love you guys so much. And until next time, I will see you all later. Don't forget to subscribe, okay? Love y'all. Peace. <laughs>